Hi, I'm Matthew Coast, head dating coach and founder at CommitmentConnection.com. And in this video, we're going to talk about um, your ex who's seeing someone else and if he still loves you. Uh, but before we talk about that, if you're struggling to attract the right man into a committed, lasting relationship, make sure you go to my website at CommitmentConnection.com and take my quiz. So today's question comes from a woman in our community, and she's asking uh, why your ex-boyfriend still thinks you're beautiful and says he loves you and you're almost perfect and is seeing someone else. I don't understand this. He knows I still love him, so why would he say these things to me? Is he just playing with my feelings? Um... The answer is no, he's not just playing with your feelings, he's just expressing his feelings is, is really what's going on there. Um, love isn't everything to most men, right? There's a lot of things that are way more important to them than love. Uh, one of them is uh, respect. Another one is <laughs> feeling good over a long period of time. And... Um, it, you know, if th there's a lot of reasons why he might not be with you uh, and he might go and uh, be with someone else, um, even if he still loves you. And some of those reasons are, you know, he might have insecurities that he needs to deal with, um, which is why he can't be with you because he's he doesn't feel worthy of being with you. That's one of them. Um, he might fit he might feel like you don't fit in uh, with some of his criteria of the type of woman or the type of relationship that he wants to have, which is why he won't be with you. So if, if he feels like, um, you know, as, as a woman, you, uh, you, you know, it could be physical, could be uh, like if you're not fully his type or if you're not... Um, uh, if, if you're not the type of woman that he would want to uh, have raising his children, like if you don't have similar values, that could be a huge, huge problem. Um, so uh, uh, he might, you know, there's other reasons too. He might, you know, need somebody who's not so serious right now because he has other things going on in his life that he needs to do or work on, like financial stuff. And so he's looking for somebody that's a little bit more casual because um, he uh, he's worried about being able to financially provide for you and a family, which is a real concern for men. I know a lot of women uh, seem to not be able to understand why men need to feel that they can do that, but there's a, a lot to that, and it's very important. Um, and if he said that you're almost perfect for him, uh, there, there's probably something missing um, that he needs from a woman that you either can't or won't fulfill for him. And so, uh, you know, I, I don't know exactly what's going on in your situation because your question is um, not really that in-depth about what's going on in your situation. But uh, it sounds like there's something that's missing for him, and he still loves you, uh, and love for him is just not enough. He needs something else. He needs, you know, maybe he needs to be able to grow with you. Maybe uh, you guys fight too much when you're together, you know? I mean... Uh, if he feels like you're fighting all the time and he doesn't want to fight all the time, he might give up on that, you know, and just say, hey, you're awesome and I love you, but, you know, we fight way too much. You know, there's there's a lot of things like that that can happen that will destroy a man's uh, desire to be with you long term and look at you as someone that um, he could potentially be with for the rest of his life. And so... Um, yeah, my suggestion is that uh, is that you let go and and that you move on and and um, you know he's probably still gonna have feelings for you. He might have feelings for you for the rest of his life. You never know. Um, uh, so I don't know. Depends on what you want. Depends on what's going on with him. Depends on what you're willing to do um, and whether uh, the criteria that he needs of you 
um, is something that you can provide or not. And if it's not, then you know my suggestion is that you move on. So that's it for this this video. If um, if you want more information on what's stopping you from attracting the right man into a committed, lasting relationship, make sure you go to my website at commitmentconnection.com and take my quiz. I'm Matthew Coast, and I'll speak with you again soon.